guys uh, wanted to make a video. Uh, if you guys are wondering why I'm wearing a blazer and a tie and a dress shirt, uh, unlike my most videos. So this video is about the reversible blazer. So uh, on our most recent trip, we wound up having to pay uh, a good amount of money on extra uh, carry-on fees and such on trips, on round trip wound up costing an extra $270 on that trip. Um, so those carry-on fees are like $35 to $50, $55, depending on which airline. So one of the things that I've started to do to save on, what do you call that, on the uh, luggage and the amount of space in my pack, the next trip for planning, um, in which case I do have to uh, have some business, um, dealings as well I decided to purchase the reversible blazer that way I can carry two for the price of one in a sense so now we have a dress shirt with this blazer and the underside is a charcoal gray let me pause the camera a second and I'll show you the different looks that you'll achieve with this blazer This is now a charcoal gray, navy blue is on the other side. So there you go guys, I just wanted to give you guys some, um, some of my ideas for saving time at the airport as well as space in your pack. Uh, all in all leading you uh, to save some money on the uh, charges that they have for those carry-on items as well as uh, sort of what has become sort of hidden fees um, on these trips. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you found this helpful um, in your upcoming planned trips as well. Uh, you know, having a versatile multi-use item uh, such as a reversible blazer and versatile colors, charcoal gray, blue, uh, navy blue, and um, black, always work well um, when you're out uh, out in town and as well as more um, semi-formal or formal events and uh, saving space in your pack these days when you're traveling uh, not only saves you weight but also saves you time at the airport and saving you money on those extra fees that they charge when you bring on carry-on items um, and also be very aware of the measurements on the packs that they'll allow you to bring on board as a personal item as they do get you with those and you might be paying extra amounts of money uh, for my choice i prefer the 32 liter pack that seems to be a safe bet thank you very much for watching please like share and subscribe and i'll see you guys later